the highlight of the saddle horse calendar was held at the Bloemfontein Showgrounds and as always proved to be not only a must-see for any equine enthusiast but an event that everyone from all ages can enjoy ranging from delicious South African delicacies to flea markets and camel rides. During the week-long event, the best of the best prove themselves worthy by battling it out in numerous classes in order to qualify for the finals on the Saturday evening. Visitors from all around the country and even some international visitors gathered to cheer on their favourites. This year's championships played host to close to a thousand horses, all competing for the coveted Blue Ribbon. Exhibitors from all ages compete in their respective classes. These include Futurity, Equitation, Harness and Gated Classes. The annual South African Saddlebred Championships are known as the biggest outdoor saddle event in the world and once again proudly sponsored by Volvo Trucks. Stay tuned to see who gets crowned the 2018 South African Grand Champion. We start the show off with the South African Grand Champion Three Gated Child's Riding Horse. Three gated horses, as the name implies, shows at three gates, which are the walk, the trot, and the canter. The horses enter the arena on a two-beat rhythmical trot with high front motion. The 2018 Children's Three-Gated Champion is Wild Knight and Nicole Bester. The next class for the evening, the 2018 SA Grand Champion Three-Gated Horse, presented by an amateur. The trot is a two-beat diagonal gait in which the front foot and the opposite hind foot take off from the ground in unison and land simultaneously. It is executed in a highly collected manner and should display the horse's athletic ability. The 2018 South African Grand Champion Three-Gated Horse, presented by an amateur, is Dark Emperor, shown by Zandri Sneeman. A strong performance by Nobles Admiral and Francois Dirksen awarded them with the title of Reserve Champion. The third place went to Completely Kali and Tareen Smith. Gate is open and entering the arena is the South African champion three-gated horse. Undulata's Made in Heaven and Junior Hugo. The gate closes, the class is complete and judging is underway. The King and I and Petro Buerta Duval showing at a trot. Supreme's Rare Dreamer and Eliska Jordan. New Year's Rock and Natasia Lotta. Wicked Knight and Adrian Udendal. <laughs> Judges ask for a walk. The walk, or animated walk, is a highly collected gait, exhibiting much crimp at a slow, regulated speed with good action and animation. It should have snap and easy control. It can be either a two-beat or four-beat gait. It is performed with great style, elegance, and airiness of motion. The judges ask for a canter. A canter is relatively slow, lofty and fluid, with a definite three-beat cadence. It is a restrained gallop in which two diagonal legs are paired. The single beat falls between the successive beats of the other two unpaired legs. Judge and jury and Nicola Berger performing a canter. Stop. 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 The judges ask the competitors to transition to a walk in order to prepare them to turn around and take the rail at trot in the opposite direction of the ring.
Judges ask the exhibitors to come in and line up their horses for final inspection. This year's South African Grand Champion three-gated horse is Supreme's Rare Dreamer, shown by Eliska Jordan. Reserve champion is Undulata's Made in Heaven, shown by Junior Hugo. In third place, Wicked Knight and Adrian Urdendal. Rest of the results are Judge and Jury and Nicola Berger, The King and I and Petro Buerta Duval, New Year's Rock and Natasia Lotta, and Limited's Heatwave and Jan Kok. The next class for the evening is unique to South Africa as it is the SA Grand Champion Single Harness Horse. Single Harness Horses enter the arena at a collected trot. Always a crowd pleaser as these horses perform their gates at great speed and precision. The South African saddle horse stands 15 to 17 hands tall and weighs roughly between 450 and 540 kilograms. Members of the breed have well-shaped heads with a straight profile, long, slim, arched necks, well-defined withers, sloping shoulders, correct leg conformation, and strong level backs with well-sprung ribs. Enthusiasts consider them to be spirited yet gentle animals. The coveted blue ribbon for this year's SA Grand Champion Single Harness Horse went to Whispering Sensation and Junior Hugo. A truly elegant class on the saddle horse program is that of the SA Grand Champion Ladies Fine Harness Horse. Glamorously dressed for the occasion, the ladies show their horses with finesse and grace. The Fine Harness Horse stands out and is truly a beautiful sight to behold. This year's SA Grand Champion Ladies Fine Harness Horse is French Perfume, shown by Elra Tonkin Beering. The reserve champion is Gallio's Flinder Street, shown by Sanet Stander. In third place, Mandarin's Delight, shown by Nicolette Smith. Join us after the ad break for more saddle horse action. Welcome back to the action with our next class, the SA Grand Champion Fine Harness Horse. Johnny Walker Red and Neil Valentine. War Prince and Paul Tao. Ultimate Joe and Charlie Brown. Fine harness horses are shown in a fine leather harness with full manes and tails pulling a four-wheel buggy. They are known as the ballerinas of the show ring, for they are always a favorite among many for the speed and elegance they combine. The judges ask for the walk. Global applause and Junior Hugo. O'Wars Duchess and Nicola Berger. Yeah. 
Judges ask the exhibitors to turn around and take the rail at a park trot. St. Anthony and C.J. Duplessis. Judges have seen enough and have asked the exhibitors to come in and line up their horses for final inspection. With such a strong class and the overall quality at such a high level, choosing a winner is no easy task. And the winner of the SA Grand Champion Fine Harness Horse is... Ultimate Joe, shown by Charlie Brown. Our reserve champion is O'War's Duchess, shown by Nicola Berger. And third place, Johnny Walker Red, shown by Neil Valentine. Of the results are War Prince and Paul Tauf, Global Applause and Junior Hugo, St. Anthony's and CJ Duplessis, Magic Moments and Audrey Mayberg, O'Kalash's John West and Jan Koch. We now move on to the final division of the evening, which is the five gated classes. And the first class on the evening's program is the SA Grand Champion Five Gated Child's Riding Horse. The blue ribbon went to That's My Way, shown by Anya Dirksen. Next up on the program is the SA Grand Champion Amateur Five Gated Horse. The title of Grand Champion went to Viva La Vida, shown by Jaco Fenter. The reserve champion is Wolf's Flame, shown by Cornet van Furen. And the third place, Touch the Wind, shown by Sally McNaughton. Ladies and gentlemen, it is now time for our final class of the evening, and it is not one you can afford to miss. It is the SA Grand Champion Five Gated Horse. Rising Music and Irene van der Westhuizen. Big Pride and Junior Hugo. Harlem Divine and Glenda Kuhn. Spartan Supreme and Neil Valentine. War Sports and Carol Badenhorst. Rocky Mountain High and Dejani Poyle. The 
judges ask for a canter. On cloud nine and Cookie de Villiers. Judges ask for a slow gate. The slow gate is a four beat gate with each of the four feet contacting the ground separately. The slow gate is a restrained four beat gate, executed slowly but with true and distinct precision. Speed is to be penalized. It is high, lofty and restrained, denoting the style, grace and polish of the horse. The judges ask for a rack. The rack is a four beat gate in which each foot meets the ground at equal separate intervals. It is smooth and highly animated, performed with great action and speed. It should be performed by the horse in an effortless manner, from the slow gait, at which point all strides become equally rapid and regular. The judges ask the exhibitors for a walk. The exhibitors are asked to turn around and take the rail at a trot in the opposite direction of the ring. This is the last chance to impress the judges. What a great performance by all of these top horses. for them to line up so the judges can make their final decisions. South African Grand Champion Five Gated Horse is Rising Music, shown by Irene van der Vestazen. Reserve champion is Rocky Mountain High, shown by Dejani Boyle.
In third place is War Sports, shown by Carol Badenhorst. The rest of the results are On Cloud 9, shown by Cookie de Villiers Big Pride, showed by Junior Hugo Spartan Supreme, showed by Neil Valentine Harlem Divine, showed by Glenda Kuhn Supreme's Cortez, showed by Jan Koch uh, I'm very grateful to have the opportunity to judge the, the national championships here in South Africa this year um, It's been a great horse show, full class full of horses, um, great quality um, it's just been a treat. The, the people have been great. They put on a great horse show. The spectators have been um, outstanding. The um, stands are filled. Um, so it was a great experience. I had a good time. I am thrilled to be here. I, throughout the years, I have heard what a great horse show this is, and I was not disappointed. It was beyond my expectations. And new for me was judging the single harness horse, and I loved it. I just thought it was so much fun. And I, I can't ever remember being welcomed better by anybody than the South Africans have treated us and it's been a tremendous experience and I'm thrilled to be back in South Africa. This is my fifth trip and it's a highlight for, for sure, for sure. We hope you all enjoyed the show and we look forward to seeing you all again next year. A special thank you goes out to all of the exhibitors and our sponsors.